This is very annoying. The sheep managed to open that gate. So lambs and yews are mixed together. Why does it matter? Because the yews are the ones that had fly strike. And some of them I have to put cream on and treat. So I don't want to have to bring the whole flock in to treat the few that need to be treated. And I bet it's your fault, Ebony. I bet it was you, hmm? I bet you did something to the gate. Yeah, because see, I've got to do treat her wounds with cream. There's the dried cream you can see. Yeah, I bet it was your fault you opened the gate. That means I'm going to have to make a gate pin so that the bolt on that gate can't open. Oh, how boring. You're having a lovely time though, aren't you? All the sheep now have to be sorted. That is a tedious bore, and I know it's your fault. You're the one who gets into everything, opens gates, knocks down fences, gets your head stuck in fences. I know it's you. I know it's you. Isn't it? Uh, that's a job I didn't want to do today, but that's farming. <laughs> oh, okay. I think the first thing I'm going to have to do before I sort sheep out is to make a gate pin. Uh, come on, Java. Come on. Come on. Leave it. Come on. Java, come on. Hey, come on. Add a good boy. Come on. Come on, you bold boy. Come on. Good girl, Inca. Come on. Java, come on. See, she was probably rubbing her head like that on the gate. And the latch went open. And she was like, oh, wow. I'd say that's exactly what happened. So I think you are the gate opener. <laughs> so I've just created a gate pin and uh, it makes it so that you can unhook the gate and you slide it through the hole. It's just one piece of wire and you do the kind of springy action at this end and then the loop in the hole here. Now I've got to go put it on the gate and make sure it fits. Now. Let me see if I can get them all in. You're not being very helpful, Java. <laughs> Java's trying. The ones up in the field aren't coming down. Come on, girls. Oh, God. Nearly tipped me over. Come on, girls. Woo! Come on. Come on. Come on, girls. Come on. Job done. Okay, they're all in. Oh, quick. Close the gates. And close the gates. And close these gates. So they're all inside now. No, 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 no. Excuse me. Get in there. There we go. Okay, now I'm going to go fix the, attach the gate pin. And then I'll have to sort the flocks out. Oh, 
farming. You never know what you're going to come across in the morning. Okay, gate pin time. Okay, this gate needs to be pinned shut because I'd say this hole, it moved. So, bolt it, and that's where the gate pin goes. And I've got to uncrook it. It's crooked at the moment once it goes through. Oh, hello, you. How are you? Yeah, I've locked you up there. You guys were where you're meant to be. Okay, I've got to undo this wrap and redo it and put it through there to make the gate pin work. Hey, girls. You're very good. So this is the gate pin is now working. So when this is rubbed, it doesn't go through. But if I just hooked something through and dangled down, the sheep's head could pop it up. So I needed a gate pin. And there we go, there's the gate pin. There are simpler versions of this. I just, it was a little bit complicated because I want to keep that closed. Sorry, you guys, you're stuck up there on your own until I sort the sheep out. Now, to go and sort sheep out, which is not what today was meant to be about. These are still flowering. Look at that. The evening primrose. Oxide daisies are doing their second flowering. Actually, some of these are the um, marguerites. Look at the spindle. The spindle is looking beautiful. And the Gilda Roseberries, all the birds have eaten most of the Gilda Roseberries. The rowans aren't big enough to flower yet. Maybe next year. Oh, look, here's some Gilda Rose. There's some berries that the birds haven't eaten. They're eating them though. You can see here, they've picked out a few there. So, yep, no, this is looking great. This is some more spindle. It didn't flower this year. Next year it'll flower. Some of these will flower and some of them won't. Look, there's a scabious right there. Whoops, excuse me. Right there, that purple is scabious. So I've planted it full of wildflowers. Oh, wow. The berries are so heavy on this, it's pulled the branch over. Well, these will straighten it up. Anyway, this is the Gilda Rose. There's my walnut tree, looking great. I love my walnut trees. Grown from seed from my grandfather's planted walnut tree. Here's some spindle turning its color. Some more Gilda roseberries. And then in here, there's, these are, um, oh, I'm being stupid, a herb. Oh, I'm being so completely stupid, I can't think. Anyway, those are herbs. Cat mint. Thank you. So there's more mint there. And this is one of the cherry trees. So, yeah, looking good. Okay, now, sort the sheep out. Oh, how boring. Okay, only one, two, three lambs left in there. The rest of them are out here. Sorted some. There's the fly struck lamb is in there. So everybody else gets to go out. Come on, babies, out you go. Nope, don't you go in there, come on. Out you go. They're going up as they came in. See, this lamb has to be in here because she's fly struck, come on. Out you go. Now, only got to sort out a few more. Okay, got to close this gate because I don't want to mix them all up again. Oh, look, I can close this gate on them. Ah, 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 Inca, leave it. So this gate, I turn this into an additional paddock that uh, I can have, and it's very convenient now. 
all of them are in there so I can let them through the gate at the top once I get the last of these lambs out. So having as many pens as possible makes life much easier. So two lambs. Let's see if I can get you guys to move on your own. Go on, go on. Okay, now. Okay, I can sort them out in there. Whoops. That's that hogget that I've got to put cream on every day. You can see her skin is not doing great. Okay. Come here. One. Two. Okay. Are you coming out? Come on. Now I'm going to put these two back in here. So it's all relatively easy. Come on. Good girl. Okay. Now, the last three to sort and the job will be done. You guys, out, 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 out. Now, let's see. Inca, leave it. Leave it. Okay. There we go. You guys can go out here now. Go on. There we go. And I know those two are on that side and the rest are there, but hey, and you can come out here. I can open this gate. So you guys can all join together again. Now, open this gate. No, 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 you stay there. You go in. You stay there, ladies. There we go. Okay. Now, to let the flock out up into that field. Now that I've got a gate pin involved in the situation. I think I'll put these guys, open this gate over here. Actually, they're going to get confused. So I better close this gate. I mean, open this gate. Okay, because you never know, sometimes sheep jump fences and then it's good to have them cut off somewhere where they can't blend into a group you've already separated lambs out from. So I've got to herd these two back. Brindle, come here, come in here. Java is squeaking out the other side of the gate because he wants to be involved. Ah, ah, ah. Inca, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. Easy, 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 good girl, easy. Leave it, leave, Inca, leave it, leave it, leave it. Okay, good girl. There we go. Okay. No, you know, Brindle, back here. Leave it. Okay, look. Just got them all pinned against the gate, just where we want them to go. But I have to unpin the gate, so I've now got to close this gate. This is separating lambs and sheep. It's always in different paddocks to do different things. There we go. Now, Inca, leave them be. You've got to behave because they're stuck up against this gate. So I have to open this gate to let them out. They're all looking quite well. So, there we go, open this gate.
Come on, babies. Come on. Come on. Woo! Come on, babies. Come on. Come on. Leave it. There we go. Now, you guys are where you're meant to be and not mixed up with the yos. Oh, look who made it through the fence. Whoops. Come on. Java, come back here. Java. Okay. I'm gonna have to fix the pin now to the gate. Because if it was just a straight hook through, the um, sheep would uh, rub it up and down and get rid of it. There we go. And there is my sheep pin, my, my gate pin. Hopefully that will work. And that a sheep won't rub it up and down and get it open. Come on, Java. Come on. Good boy. Okay, ladies, you can come out now. And you bold one, you're not going to get through the gate now. I think they're going to get up to where the lambs are. No such luck. Gate closed.